Okay, uh, just want to do a quick video. Judy showed me how to do a Vegito test in the Vector 03 on a database item. So here we have a homeopathic remedy. This is not obvious, so I thought it would be good to do a quick video. So I have a homeopathic remedy. I'm going to do absolute model. Although we just, first you want to do absolute model to see how important it is. I've already used, I've already uh, sent this to the printer. So, I don't know what it's going to come out with. Obviously, a homeopathic remedy you would think is positive, and you wouldn't want to probably need to Vegito test it. But if you do want to Vegito test anything just to see if it's going to be strengthening or weakening, this is how to do it. Uh, so, I'm just using a homeopathic remedy in this case, which should be obvious. So we have a slide here, the coronal thoracotomy at the level of the ascending part of the aorta front view. All right, it's taking a bit of time to do the absolute model, but here it goes. Let's see, come on. All righty. So it's a one, obviously it's not that needed, but we're going to do the Guido test on the remedy. So this is where it gets kind of tricky on the Vector 03. It's not obvious. It's slow because I'm recording as also, I think. Okay, so it's doing the Vegito test. So here's where it's the tricky part. So now you do exit. Okay, and uh, comparative analysis, and you're going to see this is highlighted the original slide, and you go down all the way to the bottom, and this is where I, it'll say the this is where the, the last thing the last action the remedy was checked. You highlight, you don't check it, you just highlight the item, and at the bottom here it says strengthening compensatory reaction 47%. Okay, so that's it. Make sure you, you go back to the slide, you'll see it's highlighted the item you were been you were checking. So you leave that alone, you go to the bottom and you highlight, but do not check that item. If you check that item, you'll watch what happens. It goes away. And then you have to go back up and recheck the original one. So don't check the item. Alrighty, so if you check this back again, you go to the bottom. You just highlight the item and then you'll get the results. So this is pretty obscure. Hope this helps. Thank you.